Welcome back to our third video for permanent account number. My name is Indira, your virtual advisor from Whitecroft Ford. I hope you found our last clip for an inoperative pen helpful. Today, I'm going to talk about the AO code and specifically for a foreign citizen. Great, let's begin. First of all, what is an AO code? AO code is the short form of assessing officer so an AO code is an assessing officer code. This relates to the Income Tax Department Government of India. Is it important in your PN? Absolutely. It is one of the most important parts of your PN. Okay, now let's go further into the AO code. What does the AO code consist of? Area code, AO type, range code and AO number of the jurisdictional assessing officer. The AO code correlates to a jurisdictional assessing officer acting on behalf of the Income Tax Department Government of India. By providing your AO code in your PIN, it assigns a specific jurisdiction area and respective J.O. to your PIN. This is important as it ensures the correct rules and regulations related to your PIN are in place. For example, taxation services, rebates, exemptions, and so on. Next, let's take a look at where you would obtain the correct AO code from for your PIN. You can obtain details from the Income Tax Portal, Income Tax Office, the Depository Portal, a designated PIN Center, or you can visit us on whitecraftford.com, which will help point you in the right direction. Thirdly, Let's take a look at what the official guidelines are for a foreign citizen AO code. The instructions provided by the Income Tax Department Government of India are, you can obtain your AO code from your local office of Income Tax Department in India. However, not everyone is able to do so. This may be for a number of reasons, such as you're applying for PIN from abroad, or you are unable to speak with the local office whilst in India, or simply you're just not sure. In any case, the following applies. 1. AO code pertaining to the International Taxation Directorate should be used. Or 2. In the case the applicant is unaware of the correct AO code, then the applicant can select default international taxation. Perfect. I hope that was clear and helpful. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. You'll be notified when new information is available. Thank you in advance. Lastly, I'll leave you with another helpful point. If you have an existing PIN and need to update your correspondence address, you should have this updated to avoid any administrative issues down the line. Don't forget if you need assistance in applying We Can Help, head over to whitecroftford.com. Also, our power of attorney services for India are very popular. It's a great way to move ahead with your matters in India without you having to be there in person, of course, where suitable. That's all from me today. Until again, best wishes.